that's necessarily happened for you now that you are back on the field? Is it almost like there's a newfound appreciation for being out there? Uh, yeah, you know, you got to take advantage of every opportunity you get. Um, you know, things changed. I was driving the second round before them the year before. Then they came and you know, kind of brought, brought in who they wanted. And um, things kind of changed, so I just knew I had to do everything I can plus more to get on the field. So now that I'm out there, I kind of feel good. I'm, I appreciate it more to be out there. When, when you talked to us back in, like, the preseason, the main thing you said you just want, you want to be out there on the field, you want to be able to yeah. show what you can do. So what does it mean to, like, the fact that you've gotten as much playing time as you had the last two weeks and that, you know, Coach Salah said that going forward you're going to have a role with, like, with the offense now. Like, that's, that's, uh, that's what you always wanted, right? It feels good, yeah. It's what I always wanted. I wanted to just go out there and show what I can do. Uh, it feels good to be out there. And now that I got the opportunity to go out there and show it, I'm, I'm excited. The big catch and run that you had last mm-hmm. week. I mean, what was what was that like for you? Just kind of go through the play. I felt good. I was tired of shit, but it felt good. <laughs> <laughs> it felt good to be out there catching the ball and being able to make some plays for the team and try to put us in the best position to win. There were a couple of plays too where it looked like I mean, you were you were behind the defense. You know, things happen obviously the ball is mm-hmm. behind you. But do you feel like you had obviously the big catch, but like the true big breakout game? Do you feel like it's coming? Like, is that right around the corner? Yeah, if I keep preparing myself like I like I am, which I will, um, it, it's, it's bound to happen. I just got to keep my head down, keep studying, keep staying in the playbook, and just keep grinding. And it'll come. What was Sal talking about? The last few weeks have been like it's been like a flip like, mm-hmm. for you. Like, what has it been like the last couple of weeks? Well, it's been it's been very exciting. Um, when Corey kind of went out. Um, before he kind of went out, I kind of knew that things were going to change, so I knew I had to put myself in the best position to be ready for when the game comes. So I just knew that if I just go out there and do what I'm supposed to do and do what I know I can do, then everything will fall in place. Did you look at it as an opportunity where Corey obviously left because of the injury, but you got on the field where it's like, well, now I'm not, you're not taking me off it. Like, yeah, that's, I mean, that's how I see it. I mean, Corey not on the field right now, so I'm like, okay, I'm going to be on this field the whole game. So I'm just trying to do everything I can. Has it better Corey say anything to you then? Like, hey, we need you now? Or yeah, well, I mean, me and Corey always talk. we we very good friends. We always talk every day, all day. So he just kind of keep me, tell me, keep my head up, and just keep working. My time will come. Do you feel you're a different player mentally than you were when you were first drafted? Oh, yeah, for sure. It definitely. In what ways? Definitely. Nothing phases me, really. Um, kind of let this thing, that thing get bothered me early on. I was young then, but I kind of grew and kind of been in a lot of situations where I can control my mind, don't let anything really affect me. So I've been doing a way a much better job doing that. Is, is that why you were able to, you know, you were frustrated? Is that why you were able to kind of get through it and still stay prepared? For oh, it? yeah. I just I really, honestly, uh, God helped me get through it all, honestly. I'm a big believer in God, so I always pray to, I always pray to God every day and uh, just trying to do everything I can. So God helped me get through it, and thank God for it. Did your um, your grandma make up for the game last week, or is she coming to this one here? I'm going to see her next week. She yeah. wanted to come, but I told her to wait because she's going to be the only one to be able to come, not yeah. my other family. So I just told her to wait. Honestly.